In my last video, um, I touched on how important reconciliation tools are for me as a bookkeeper when evaluating an accounting software. There are two main kinds that we see in modern bookkeeping. The first one is pretty prevalent right now at the time of this recording in 2023, and that is the balance reconcile. What that means is that the accounting software is presuming that the bank data that it is getting automatically from the bank accounts is accurate and trustworthy and therefore all that's needed is a double check at the end of every month to make sure that the the balance in the accounting software for the bank accounts matches with what is shown on the statement now here's why I don't like this version bank account freak out regularly and if this is the only tool that you have to identify uh, where there's a problem it means that if there's a problem you are going to spend a lot of time trying to track it down because you have no other tools all you can do is one by is draw up reports and then try to figure out how to one by one make sure that everything is accounted for in the software. That's why I prefer kind of an old fashioned one to one uh, check marking system. I want to be able to see a list of transactions in uh, my accounting software and I want to be able to pull up a PDF version of my statement and mark on the statement and then mark in my accounting software that I have confirmed that that transaction exists and I want to be able to do that for every single transaction and once they do and I know all of the balances make sense and are correct I want to be able to save all of that information so that if there's a problem in the future I don't have to look at all of those transactions that I reconciled and checked individually, right? They've been vetted carefully enough that I shouldn't have to go back and look at them. So I really prefer this second method and I advocate for it very strongly because I find that systems that trust bank feeds um, are fine until there's a problem and then it's always a time suck, a huge time suck to figure figure out where the problem is and to fix it, which is costly for my clients.